Okay, so the breech plug on my Thompson Center Omega uh, became extremely um, tight. I wasn't able to get it loose. It was seized up completely uh, at the end of the season last year. And I had a hard time finding good information on um, how to get it unstuck without taking it to a gunsmith. So I figured I would do a quick video to explain what worked for me. Um, I have removed the scope from the gun. Um, I started off just trying to get it done with um, these little um, breech plug wrenches that uh, Thompson Center had put out. And I still had the scope on it. And I put it in a padded vise. And it actually, these, these wrenches are pretty much worthless unless, you know, if you're dealing with a, a situation where it's seized and you can probably see the, uh, may or may not be able to see that it actually busted the wrench. So I got another wrench and I took the scope off and I tried to lubricate around the, uh, breech club, uh, uh breech plug with coil um, and give it another go and I thought you know the issue might have been partially that I couldn't get a good purchase on it with the scope on and I you know with the scope off I busted another one of the wrenches so a padded vise not working you really need a gun vise um, I have a tipped in it's plastic and I really was skeptical that that was going to work just because it's plastic and I couldn't, you know, with the, the padded vise, I couldn't, couldn't get the job done. Um, but it, I gave up on the padded vise and I cinched it down in the Tipton, uh, Tipton plastic gun vise and that actually was able to get it completely locked down. What I did next was... The coil, I put a liberal amount of coil down the barrel and then swabbed it down with just uh, some patches, you know, and then I, I ran the ramrod all the way down so that the coil was, um, you know, there was pressure on it against the um, barrel side of the breech plug. And I also squirted some in around the outside of the breech plug and used uh, some swabs there just to kind of hold it in place. I left it for a couple days and I got a socket wrench right here and cinched it down as good as I could in the Tipton gun vise which actually held it and then you know at first uh, there was just a, a tremendous amount of pressure um, and then eventually was able to get it one little bit at a time and then it came loose and I got it out cleaned the breech plug and um, it's as good as new now I think the lesson here is you know to go ahead and take the breech plug out every time um, at least once every year I'd probably let it go a few years um, just swabbing the barrel and cleaning it out without removing the breech plug is not a good idea uh, I don't know that you have to remove it every time you run cleaning patches down the barrel, but I'd say at least at the end of the year, go ahead and remove it. But that's what worked for me. So the, the Tipton gun vise, a good socket wrench um, is, is crucial, and the coil. Uh, anyway, thanks for watching. Hope it helped.